But we do begin on this Sunday with breaking news. An incredible story about a missing teenager found alive eight years after he disappeared. ABC 13's Brooke Taylor has been gathering information about his return. She joins us live. Brooke, these stories don't always have happy endings, but this one appears to have a resolution. Exactly, Tom. That's why you could just imagine this family's relief after a long eight years. So Rudy Farias was 17 years old when he was first reported missing. Now that would make him 25 years old. So back in March of 2015, officials said that Rudy Farias was walking his two dogs right near Tidwell and Park Drive. His family reported him missing after his dogs were found, but Farias never returned. His family told officials at the time he was diagnosed with depression and anxiety. Texas EquiSearch started asking the public for help trying to find him, saying that he was possibly disoriented and he had not been taking his medication. His mom spoke to us in 2017. She stayed anonymous because she was afraid that she believed her son's disappearance was suspicious. Someone out there knows something, anything. I just want the closure that not knowing this torture. And the Texas Center for Missing People tweeted out earlier that he was now in the hospital. We have calls out to officials. There are still a lot of questions right now, like where he was found and where he has been. Of course, these last eight years, we are going to try and get those answers. Live in Houston, I'm Brooke Taylor, ABC 13. I witness news.